Elon Musk Corey bought. Bought, he bought like six. He bought seven percent of Twitter. Nine point. He bought, bought a bunch of guy. Twitter. He owns 9. Twitter. Nine point two. Okay, and he's acting. He's acting out, and he's like a member of the board, and he's been doing a lot of polls on Twitter. Okay, like such as should we remove the W from yeah. Twitter? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what kind of porn he's watching. Actually, I don't. Ew, 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 ew. I, ew, I don't want to know. <laughs> no, you're right. Something so weird. It's probably so weird to be him. Mm-hmm. Um, he should bring Trump back. I know. But, Obviously. No, I know, but he... I would be like, I would be grateful. And yeah. I would, because I have very low esteem of Elon Musk, because I just think he's like soulless and kind of a slob you know like he's not particularly virtuous to me in any way no he's um but if he brought trump back virtuous. he would be i would kind of be like mm, that was cool mm-hmm. of elon to do when he <laughs> you would consider having a child with him no. if he brought trump back because i think he's really into having children with as Ew. many women as possible okay <sighs> gross post-humanist he another like, mace that's a, probably another like thing with masonic roots honestly yeah but that like, like transhumanist kids, impulse. which is crazy he just he he's like a black man he just like nuts <laughs> he has it's nine cool. kids yeah he can afford it yeah no i know it's cool that he just like nuts <laughs> and doesn't look back <laughs> Yeah, and easily. <laughs> I kind of i ha- I have a newfound appreciation for Elon Musk. Okay, based. I mean, on... I, I I'm physically repulsed by him and hate everything he stands for. But <laughs> uh. <laughs> I am physically repulsed by him. I really am. I don't yeah. even really. Well, like... no, you know why? Because because huh? he looks very Russian. In a way, he does. Yeah, yeah. he's like maybe that's why a man with. Oh like, yeah. <laughs> um cute feminine features and overly pouty lips which is like <laughs> hot in a woman but disgusting in a man he's like leo dicaprio but yeah you know he's gross and like annoying he, but you I sound have, like you might really like him yeah no no i don't but um i have a, a newfound appreciation for him because i like that he's like consistent in his like retarded troll sense of humor yeah and that he totally. puts himself out there and i have to say to <laughs> elon's credit mm-hmm. um that's so sweet of you that's actually very charitable that's like, nice i should yeah no, regard I mean, him I, more humanely we have to than... see we have to judge people by their peace mm-hmm. and not their values <laughs> as my mom always says ripping off i, I don't know who she stole that's from, so like, Pushkin true or though, something. Yeah. no it's true it's so true yeah it's easy for us who can afford to buy and sell things on the real real but um we're the real real class yeah we are yeah (laughs) but um he he like literally just like does have a sense of humor and has like um, he does it's not for i don't find it particularly funny and i do he has it it, (laughs) which is more than you can say for i know and he has um an artistic impulse yeah but he's what is his sign that's a good question probably an aquarius i know maddie likes him shout out maddie maddie likes elon Musk. she doesn't she likes that he's like a slob that's she like Um, (laughs) she has that kind of do i hear (gasps) is eli coming no eli yeah what do you think about elon musk (laughs) what do you think about eli musk it's june 28th so he's (laughs) yeah yeah He's a like, Leo. What's your honest opinion? Oh no, he's Elon a can- cancer. <gasps> cancer is not good. Right? He says he's kind of interesting, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, 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 Eli. We woke Eli up. <laughs> Yelling about Elon Musk. Sorry. I think he's a cancer. June twenty okay. eighth. June twenty eighth. Is cancer, I believe. Yeah, it's like cancer Leo. Class. That's not good. Cancer's my least fave sign, easily. Sorry. Ooh. Um, I know I'm gonna get heat for that one, but wait, why is it your least favorite sign? I like male cancers. I don't know many female cancers. Every time I've had like kind of some negative not every time, but I don't know. I've had a lot of negativity with cancers in my life. Wait, really? 
Yeah. Or Cancer, they're a water sign. They're a water sign. So you'd think like being Scorpio is really be vibing, mm-hmm. you know, but Cancer is just not so much. Yeah. And I don't have many female Tauruses in my life, but I always I, respect them because I'm like, that's nice. They're scary. I don't love They them. seem grounded in a way that I'm really... In- I have almost no earth in my chart, so that's why I'm... Wait, so, really? Like, basically none. That's why I'm such a, like an airhead. I'm kind of like... <laughs> don't. Wait, that's, I'm like all earth. Well, we're perfectly balanced. I know. In the, zodi- in the zodiac. It's- <laughs> and people I'm say cusp Michael still- Tracy. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like that guy that got hit by the train. The Wait, who got hit by a train? Some like blue check guy that like Hillary Clinton tweeted about dying. Wait, what? I, he was like, and then Michael Tracy tweeted that he's never had a pleasant interaction with him, but he was sad about his sudden death. <laughs> Wait, and he wait. like got hit by a train. Like obviously the Clintons killed him or something. Wait, like who got? Wait, some guy got <laughs> some the Hilton. Tra- the Hiltons, the Clintons tweeted about got hit by a train <laughs> in New York, in like New Jersey or something. But I don't know his name or any like I don't have any more info. Than I'm that. sorry, but how do you get hit by a train as a man <laughs> in this day and age? Maybe he killed himself or something like that. It's clear, and then like oh. you know, but maybe the Clintons killed them i don't know they shouldn't be tweeting they wouldn't bother people sudden death with a body count like that they shouldn't be tweeting about um sudden deaths really at all they shouldn't be weighing in or should nor should michael tracy (laughs) i think it's cute i forgive michael tracy i love michael tracy i really do i would like we need to have him on the show again we should he go to ukraine or something yeah we should have him on we should have him on Eli was like, you need to have Michael Tracy and Glenn Greenwald on because he actually dutifully listens to the podcast. It's really sweet. Um, oh, that's But nice. I think he's kind of like as a, mm. a straight male, he prefers the episodes where we have like a male guest explaining things to us <laughs> versus when we're like, what's your sign? No, what's your sign? Did you shoplift today? <laughs> yeah tell me about the last time you shoplifted <laughs> it's like pornography for women <laughs> like, i got a drunken elephant mask from some <laughs> <laughs> oh. i got a little leather jacket that mm-hmm. i'm just like like a little like it was like some japanese but mm-hmm. like basically like a biker jacket mm-hmm. and i was just like never gonna i'm never gonna wear a little biker jacket you know like what kind of biker jacket like a like a little cropped kind it just like Mm -hmm. even though it was like japanese and just like a little bit cooler than that it's still i was like i really just don't think i can do it and it was kind of stiff and i was like oh south give this this is not sparking joy as mary kondo says you have to throw everything away that doesn't spark joy no, but it true. takes a long time because you have to go through everything and she says you have to do it all at once or it won't work that's true it won't like transform your life mm-hmm. if you still have like ephemera i know around and i have so much like i really have so much stupid crap you have to clear your closet because we have to go to vegas to see morrissey and we're gonna be buying up some merch we're gonna be buying we're gonna be spending in vegas yeah. and gambling yeah we I should would, just do a pod in vegas honestly we could do i would love go to, to the I've strip i've never been my hometown i know <laughs> i would love to go we could have my parents <laughs> yeah and just like apologize like japanese style yeah like, and i could say she's calling, sorry to I'm, my dad i'm so sorry for <laughs> calling you a neo-nazi it's like what <laughs> um Oh my god, I feel so bad that I offended your dad and my mom. I really do. I'm gonna like I become know. Catholic over I this. Know. I'm gonna say penance. I feel so bad. You feel guilty. You disrespect them. I literally do not care anymore. And people are like, "You're a fascist and a non-binary." <laughs> Just like whatever. <laughs> but <laughs> I feel so bad for offending. Yeah, our parents. I know. I know. <laughs> and that's not what we do here on the podcast. We fall, we fall in line. Was there, what else was on the docket? I don't fucking know. I'm just going to look at our text really quick and make sure there's nothing we miss. <laughs> and then we can call it because it's late. Um, sorry. No, it's fine. <laughs> sorry, I'm just looking at my text. Um, Donald Trump endorsed um, Dr. Dr. Oz. <laughs> 
<laughs> you said didn't know Dr. Oz was a Republican. <laughs> Pretty interesting. I kind of can could guess that about him. That he's a Republican. I mean, yeah. I guess he's Turkish. Yeah. So. Mm. 